Hey, welcome in everybody. We are live in Southern California as Miami is taking on USC. Side me in the booth tonight is going to be Cincy Bowen, Coach Bowen. What's up, buddy? What's going on, Jimmy? What is going on? Yeah, we got a 3-0 and versus a 0-3. Um, I'm ready to see some upset football. It's rainy here in uh, SoCal, and uh, I'm looking for uh, a hard-hitting matchup. Hmm. It looks like the uh, weather trucks aren't uh, cooperating right now. Rain sucks anyway. Yeah. Yeah, we'll give it about uh, another load up, and maybe we'll have some uh, clear weather. Yeah, definitely uh, excited to see this matchup here yeah, tonight. We got the number one offense, uh, Miami U coming in here, uh, averaging over 50 points a game. I mean, this is a hard-hitting team. We don't know if we saw a stat earlier. We don't know if it's a glitch, but it looks like uh, they're only gaining one, only allowed one yard rushing a game. One yard rushing a game. That's got to be a glitch. We got to ask him about that after the game. Yeah, we got to look into that for sure. Where's our briefcase? That's an astounding low number. Yeah, but if you look at the matchup on paper here tonight, folks, uh, USC uh, has all the check marks. 95 overall, 91 offense. Uh, defense is uh, matched up nice and evenly, 97-97 all. Um, I'm expecting this to be a, a classic slobber knocker. Try this again. We'll see what kind of weather we get this time. Yeah, don't sleep on this USC uh, defense. They are pretty good. They are fast at every position. Yeah, anybody near the channel? Seven minute quarters, Heisman difficulty, uh, everything pretty much uh, base sliders wise, um, and let the uh, user skill take its uh, take its course. Both right. competitors look nice and relaxed. Yeah. 49 in the USC Trojans. They just got off a, a beautiful vacation. Uh, he took them all the way down to the coastline, brought them back, and uh, they should be nice and relaxed and uh, ready to go, I believe. Probably had some delicious seafood. Oh, you know that. <laughs> You're living down there. You're getting the best. And here we go. Looks like we got the uh, weather nice and cleared up after uh, that little short weather delay. It looks like we could be ready to go. I think the and rain looks, mess, you, uh, messes games up. Oh, no. Mm. Well, we're both on uh, version 18, I'm sure, which I don't think that really matters. The only other thing that could it be is either a uniform issue, maybe, or a uh, playbook. I think in the past when this has happened, we've had them both leave the dynasty and jump back in. That could work as well. Weird. Let me try one more time. Okay. <clears throat> well, we can't blame it on the rain this time. Damn it. <laughs> I was hoping to blame the yeah. rain. Yeah, unfortunately, it might just be a uh, electrical issue as far as uh, some burnt wires, but we should get them cleaned up. Just got to follow the one that's short. We got breaking news that maybe the Dalton brothers are involved. Mm. I know we heard Rick and the uh, or uh, Mike, I believe it was last week. He was in the booth. Yeah, those guys have been uh, on a high hiatus now for more than six months. 
call that jail. <laughs> Russia? <laughs> As she shoils. <laughs> All right. Usually third time's a charm. With anything else, folks, let's uh, see if we can get it rocking. I look like the guys are coming up to the tunnel. Looks like they're about ready. Looks like uh, 49er George runs a uh, classic uh, West Coast. You know, he likes to keep it West Side is the best side, is his motto. Snossages is uh, locked in like always. Hopefully we get some uh, classic NCAA revamp football here tonight, folks. Two restarts, but let's not get uh, discouraged quite yet. And hopefully we can get a game on the way. Yeah, they happen at the beginning. That's a good sign. Ten-year-old server. Got to bear with it. And there it is, folks, that one yard. That's wild. One yard in three games. He's given up three yards rushing. Here we go. Let's get past this uh, coin toss here. Tails never fails, and they're going to flip it up. It's going to be heads. And 49er will elect to kick. Snossages should be getting balled half, bar no connection issues. Okay, here we go, looking good. Beautiful day here in SoCal, looks like. No rain. Yeah, we got everything to uh, everything to clear out. <laughs> Such a tease. Mm. You know, you get one or two of these games a year, and unfortunately, uh, mm -hmm. we're getting at a time where nobody wants it. You know, we just want to see some football. Quick playing with us, EA. So now we'll just have both coaches reload the dynasty and go from there. Thanks for bearing with us, everybody. This is the old console struggle. Yeah, like I said, we don't get too many of these. Uh, so hopefully uh, we'll get past this here shortly. I get some more people to, you know, get their seats and, uh, you know, get the... Uh, crowd and the uh, anticipation more uh, built up and you know gives us a little bit more to chat about if anybody's not watching the uh, all-star game right now the NLL the NL is uh, leading two to nothing uh, RBI by Mookie Betts followed by a solo shot by Paul Goldschmidt so NL is leading two to nothing All right, we're getting that invite. No spreads this week by Miller Time uh, Sportsbook. Um, got a family thing going on, and uh, hopefully we'll get some spreads next week. Wish Miller Time the best, him and his wife. For sure, for sure. I don't want to say anything I'm not supposed to say, so I'll just keep it short and sweet. Oh, I didn't even see that wishes and congrats down there. <laughs> <laughs> Very classy, Jimmy. Take care of our bookie. For sure, for sure. 
and puts uh puts paper in our uh, bank account. <laughs> All right, I'm looking for some hardeners uh, running this game. You know, what I'm saying out of George, um, maybe, hopefully, maybe he can open up that play action against this Miami Hurricanes. Got to get a good running base. You got to show that you're not scared of that number one rush defense. Definitely got to gain more than one yard rushing. Yeah, you got to get average. some established. <laughs> now you got to play tight defense against uh, Miami U. Got a lot of playmakers. Here we go. Here we go once again, the fourth time here, folks. Hopefully we can get something rolling here. <laughs> and once again, USC wins the toss. He will kick. Everybody's holding their collective breaths. <laughs> yeah, it's getting to that point, you know, where you just... Uh, that reschedule on it. But we're looking good. Very clear out here. The wind's breezing out here. Two miles an hour. Everybody's stretching, moving. Lewis, the kick. The ball is up. And we will get no return. Number four is just going to put that beautiful hand up. And uh, we're going to take it out to the 25-yard line. It looks like we're going to be playing some football, boys and girls. Giddy up. I'm excited. Miami and the all-whites. USC's rocking the traditional yellow pants. I love it. Yeah, this should be a uh, traditional game, uh, back and forth. I expect the, uh, a lot of punches, a lot of blocks, and uh, whatever comes in between. And here we go. Van Dyke taking it out of the eye formation, right up to the middle. And that's going to be an easy, easy nine-yard runs by Donald. Cheney's a good back, very fast. Got a great line in front of him. It's a good mixture. For sure, Jimmy. And here he goes, bringing the uh, big bodies right back up to the line. Pistol formation, making a check. Man in motion. Hand off to Cheney, right up the middle once again. Looks like he might have got another 11 yard gain there. And it's. Pounding city all day long, Jimmy. Yeah, he had the two tight ends on the right, went to the weak side of the left, still picked up big yardage. I like it. Yeah, it's just uh, power running right now. Trust your line. Cheney, two rushes, 20 yards. Van Dyke under center once again. Showing run, a pitch out to Cheney to the right side. Big spin move makes it something look pretty. A little something out of nothing. Eight yard gain, very nice for Miami U. Yeah, nice little spin shook two guys, picked up an extra six yards. Good play. Yeah, Cheney looks like he's in uh, mid-season form right now. Um, getting a lot of action left to right side. They're stretching out the ball. They're looking good here, and it looks like they're going back to the more of the same. Van Dyke over the middle, hand off to Cheney right up the middle. An easy three-yard game for the first down. Actually, I'm sorry, that's Jalen uh, Knight. Yeah, I think we got uh, Cheney probably getting a little breather there after those couple big rushes he just had. Yeah, I don't, don't, I don't, uh, <coughs> I don't blame him, and I'm sure anybody that's behind uh, Cheney is going to be just as good, if not, you know, compatible for the next few years to come. It's the U. Exactly. Man motioning out to the right side. Quick handoff. Cheney back in motion. Spinning like a laundry machine. And Cheney get another two-yard rush there. It looked a lot like a lot more. 
Yeah, Cheney's not afraid to take a guy head on as we saw right there. Good run. Very strong. Yeah, it could have been an easy loss, but uh, manages to pick up too. Yeah, kept the legs churning. Does exactly what the back has to do. And looks like we're going to see uh, Van Dyke out, out of the center once again. Man in motion. Play action. Gets it out to Hodges, but quickly, USC defense is there to meet him. A gain of uh, no yards. Looks like we got a minus one. Yeah, great coverage there by the Trojans. They were not falling for that play action at all. So far that he's put the tight ends in, in these formations, and they've just been decoys. So we'll see if that changes. Yeah, we got a big third and nine coming up. Ball on Miami's 40-yard line. And here we go. Van Dyke out of the shotgun formation. Hand off to Cheney, though. And just keeps it pound and ground. Another 14-yard rush. Makes it look like a pass and ends up being a rush. Yeah, huge hole. Just hat on hat blocking up front. Just made that hole. Not much you can say about it. Yeah, pure confidence on the O-line and uh, Cheney. Um, that's ballsy, but it worked very, very well, actually. Five rushes, 44 yards now. Current drive, two minutes and 44 seconds. Shotgun formation, making some checks over to the right side. Looks like he could be audibling to a whole new play. Play action, quick pass. Mm. Ooh. And reading the third, 14-yard reception. Yeah, he got up and got in the air and made sure he was getting that first because that speedy Rick Ross was closing in quickly. Yeah, he did that uh, little uh, hurdle move, and I thought he might have jumped over everybody and might have uh, gone to the end zone. But uh, USC does a good job of uh, knocking out the big body. Here we go. Shotgun spread formation. Making some checks. Van Dyke seeing what he likes. Play action. Quick pass mm. out to the outside. And Pope, a 13-yard reception for a touchdown. Yeah, that was just a timing route thrown perfectly. Van Dyke threw it before the wide receiver and made his break. Yeah, that beautiful rehearsed play there. Nine plays, 72 yards, three minutes and 20 seconds. Let's see what USC's got up their, up their sleeve. You should see a touch back here with the big leg. Balls up. And Bryant Jr. would not be able to take this one out. It's one thing the NWO offers is kickers with big legs. For sure. And USC would be taking the ball out on the 25-yard line. Curious to see what USC comes out in here, folks. It's crazy, this full house with the, uh, the All-Star game right around the corner. Yeah, exactly. we got a lot of, uh, <laughs> lot of things going on here right now in, uh, in Cali. <laughs> and here we go. Shotgun spread formation. Gets the ball out quick, and that's going to be a, a quick INT. Mm. Great blitz pickup, though, on the uh, – I think it was by the back there. I didn't get to catch it in time, but whew, Dart bot got killed. Yeah. Dart made a nice little throw, but unfortunately, uh, Brooks was right there, the junior. Oh, it's and Moss. And that was Miller Moss. I'm yeah. sorry. Moss is back. And a quick hand out to Cheney out of the two back set. Four yard rush, 48 yards with six carries so far, averaging eight yards. Cheney a little slow to get up there. I think the uh, Trojans put a hit on him pretty good there. But that's probably the best defense they've done on Cheney there. He have his least amount of run there, four yards. Yeah, they've uh, plugged Cheney up a couple times. He's just had a couple big breaks, and uh, they've done a good job of keeping the pressure. Looks like uh, USC bringing down some defenders, trying to keep a short box, quick pass, great defense. Pope minus one yard reception. 
yeah, that corner was ready for that quick throw on that slant, and he uh, wrapped up. Nice tackle. Great play. Yeah, USC, and uh, instead of uh, backing up, this time they uh, show some pressure, stayed close to the guys, and uh, made a play. Yeah, that's all you can ask. Yeah, it looks like they uh, had maybe a couple secret practices down there on the uh, down there on the shore. And here we go. Big third down. Shotgun formation, man in motion. Play action, another man across out there. And that's going to be Keyshawn Smith, seven yard reception, first down, first and goal on the six. Yeah, out route to the uh, strong long side of the field is a tough throw. Got to have a strong arm quarterback for that, and like Van Dyke prove he can make that throw. Yeah, those out routes have been uh, have been uh, open for uh, Coach Snossich here. Say so maybe if you're a 49er, you got to start tightening that up. Quick mm. pass once again. There is a flag on the play. The way Miami's reacting, it's on them. Yeah, offensive pass under Pickference. Looks like Pope got a little handsy. We do have breaking news. Carlos Stanton went deep. Don't call me Mike. Three nothing. Here we go. No two one now. Oh, two Quick hand off the chain. He makes a move, breaks a tackle, gets it up to the five yard line, and that's going to be second and goal. Great run by Chaney. He's just so strong for such a small package. Yeah, it looks like we got a tie ball game two two. As far as the uh, baseball world goes. USC got to do to stop Cheney here. Uh, it's what's anybody got to stop any of these backs in the NWL? Stack up that box, play tough, make good tackles. Do exactly what uh, Cincinnati didn't do yesterday. Here we go, hand off to Cheney. He meets mm. the line and stuffs him up. Looks like he might have the ball in the one or the two, and it will be the one yard line. Good defense. Very good defense. He Third and right. goal. Even when they hit him early, he still gets that fall forward animation. Yeah, as long as you, uh, as long as you didn't see those points come up on the board, great defense. And here we go. Their bigs versus USC's bigs. Here we go. Toss out to the outside. They have a good opportunity to stop this, and they do. Fourth and goal. And it looks like the uh, offensive coordinator did not like what he saw there. <laughs> no, he's getting in that coach's ear, isn't he? Uh, Rick Ross looked like he was shot out of a cannon, and it made Cheney change his direction immediately. Great play by that Trojan D. Yeah, they brought the pressure, and uh, it paid off for him. That's for sure. And here we go. Miami's getting aggressive. This is exactly what you like to see from Miami. If they're going to hang with Texas A&M and Iowa and all these other big schools, they got to get the points, and they got to get the Ooh. pound. And guess what? USC steps up. Big stop. He rung his bell. What a hit. Great penetration. Just everything right there. Great defense. Yeah, that's not something you normally see from Miami. Normally Miami uh, plays the smart game, takes the points, and uh, they must feel really confident in this defense they have. After that play, I would. Wolf takes it out. Yeah. The big bad Wolf takes it out. Two-yard gain there. Anything positive at this point for USC is uh, – is a is a big game. Just want to keep moving that ball forward. Moss now making some checks. Big bad wolf back in. Gets another two yard gain. Third and six. And the big bad wolf is looking for some uh, some piggies to pick on. <laughs> and that wraps up the first. Yeah, that was a quick first quarter. Very quick, very clean. Only saw one penalty. Here we go, Moss under center, making some checks, making sure everything's perfect. Got Trig Davis forward out there, right over the middle to Davis. Big yardage there for Davis, and that's going to be a first down and more. Great play. Great pocket presence. Found his man wide open. He needs to build that confidence back up after that first thrown 
INT. Yeah, that's exactly what you want after a big defensive stop like that. Moss right back underneath center here. Ross in the backfield by himself. Making some checks. Moss back on the run. And down he goes. And that is a user sack, folks. And we're going to get a quick hurry up here. Huge play. Loss of five. Yeah, second and five here. Down but not out. Moss back under center. Making some more checks. Moss making that quick throw, but nobody's there. And the uh, USC coach is wanting a flag. A lot of pressure there. Didn't even let him get off the five-yard mark. Moss coming back out, shotgun formation. Three to the right side. Moss steps back, trips him up, keeps on going, and somehow finds the first down marker and just a little bit more. But the most important thing is he gets the first down. Amazing. <laughs> Moss just tiptoed on some fingertips. I don't know how he didn't get tackled there, but amazing scramble, nice run, first down. Trojans live on. Yeah, got a little Lady Luck going on their side right here. Moss back under center. Davis in motion. Miami defense pressuring. Show some buffer zone. Two guys mixing it up. <laughs> wow. And a quick sack. Wow. Untouched jailbreak. I don't yeah, I don't know what kind of defense that is, but that was nasty. You got safety switching positions. You got guys going over here. But Moss, it's not effective. It's back to hurry up formation. Making those final adjustments once again. Moss back, quick pass, curls for the girls, and he can't come back. Ooh, can't come up with it. Thought he had it there for a second, but it pops out. Yeah, good timing by the corner. He got there right when the ball did and jarred it loose. Yeah, I got that hand in there. Third and 14 now. Big play for the Trojans. Huge third down here. Davis in motion. Oh. Throws it over the middle. Does have a guy open, but Miami closes in and is able to tip it away. Fourth yeah. down. Fourth and 14, we should see a pun here. And looks like USC is going to be coming out for it, folks. Let's let, them not, let that 0-4 season right now, they look like they're uh, looking to make a big impact early here. Interesting call. We'll see what happens. Moss went back, had a guy wide open, just kind of got a little pressure on him. Couldn't get the throw that he possibly wanted. And it looks like uh, USC's uh, confidence in their defense as well. Yeah, I like Moss's ab <clears throat> ability to get out of the pocket and keep the play alive. Uh-oh. High pass, one-on-one -on -one ball, and that's going to be a nice user catch there for the TD. Reading the third. is going to put this game up 14-0 right now, going into the second quarter. Wow, what a play. What a throw. What a catch. Yeah, Van Dyke with that big arm. Sees the target that he wants, and he puts it up. And the crowd is still definitely into it. USC just needs to find what they want to do here. Needs to find their formula that works for them. Yeah, still plenty of football here. Crowd sticking around, which is good to see. No one's heading over to the baseball game. 
Yeah, I've seen some things that I like. I've seen some things that have been open. And uh, they still got time, and they can. Uh, they got the personnel to move the ball. Moss under center. Wow. Those big bodies are just getting to it. Is that Miller? Yeah, I think Coach George needs to have a talk with that O-line coach. Something's going on with that front six, five, who, however many he's got. Yeah, that was an absolute bulldozer there. And that would be coming out in the uh, shotgun formation as well. Especially if my line gave up on me like that. And here we go. Moss back under center. Sees it something that he likes. Mm. Got Ford. And he's moving. And he's a trucking. And he is Ford tough out here, folks. That's a first down. <laughs> That uh, Miami defender sold on that pick six and was just a hair late. Just missed it. Great pass to catch. They <laughs> That's what they do. They try to sneak in there and get it, and he definitely sold, and uh, Ford took the opportunity to get that first down. Moss now. Read option. Nope. Oh, sails the pass out. Has a guy wide open out there, and Moss just floats that ball on out. Unfortunate for the USC Trojans with a man wide open out there. Could have picked up a nice little chunk of uh, yardage there. Something yeah. they need it desperately right now. Yeah, that was, that's a tough break there. But you got to put it in the rearview mirror. That's the uh, linebacker, by the way, Rick Ross, carrying the ball. Mm. Mr. Two Way. Appreciate you heard that. it yourself from uh, Jimmy Two Blunts. Rick Ross out here, two-way player. Shotgun formation, making some checks here now. Could be looking for something big over the top. And once again, this Miami front line just gets to Moss. It's going to be another big sack, fourth and 19. And this time the Trojans should send up the uh, special teams. Yeah, I can't tell if they're blitzing or if their front four is just getting through. Or a little bit of yeah, both. It's, uh, yeah, I have to go back and look at the uh, Saturday breakdown. Wisely lets it go. You see how they do it in Miami? They got the, uh, they brought the the buffet right to the uh, right to the coach's <laughs> box <laughs> fresh drinks <laughs> number three combo meals i mean shit that's nice yeah i, I saw him try to sneak that water burger in but i could smell it <laughs> <laughs> oh i can see those jumbo cups <laughs> van dyke shotgun formation three white outs to the right side little motion to the left side Quick little pass. Now it looks like Cheney's gonna, almost going to get an eight-yard gain there. Yeah, not a bad little play. There's a lot of commotion there up front. I think USC was there. They just couldn't wrap him up at first. Yeah, even though Miami's spread out, you know, don't don't think they won't throw it absolutely quick and uh, short and try to get their legs to do it. And here we go. A nice little quick pass over top there. And number three, Smith, comes down with it. It's going to be another first down for this Miami uh, offense. Yeah, the ball looked maybe a little errant. I think Smith might have went up and got that a little bit. So nice catch there by Smith. Yeah, everybody uh, taking the role here on the Miami uh, offense. Van Dyke, shotgun formation. Sits back. Uh-oh. Over top, big oh. play, and Thompson almost came down with it. Woo, Van Dyke a little bit short on the throw, but Thomas almost reaped the benefits, and thank God for uh, Miami, just a uh, deflected pass. That man came out of nowhere. Great play, needed that, but hey, still, he didn't get, the offense didn't catch it, so it's a win for the D. Oh, definitely, great play. Mm -hmm. Quick pass now. Just talking about those. Got to make something out of nothing. That's going to be another big first down there. Van Dyke with these quick throws. 
Yeah, he's, he was there just short on the tackle, though. Yeah, everybody doing their job blocking on the uh, outside, and looks like that big tight end was had enough to get that first down. Five wide now. Van Dyke back. Takes off with his feet. Burns a couple. Breaks a tackle. And looks like he gains nine, a second and one now. With a little over two minutes left in the second quarter. Mm. Van Dyke just missed the collisions with Rick Ross. That could have been ugly. Yeah, it's a big hit from your quarterback. Not something you don't want to see, but hey. They're trying to move the ball. They're trying to win this game. Here we go. Five wide once again. And Van Dyke taking off a couple broken tackles once again out here looking like Tim Tebow. And that's a big first down. Yeah, that was all Van Dyke. He was wrapped up in the backfield, shrugged it off. Got two, got like two or three yards enough for the first. Shotgun formation. Van Dyke. Man in motion, chaining to the outside. USC pressuring, foreman on him. Looks like they might just throw it away, and they do. And live to fight another day, and Van Dyke takes a big hit there, folks. Yeah, he got slow up. to get up, but on the less, he does get up, though. Yeah, he got up real slow there, Bowen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're using Van Dyke more than they usually do uh, with his feet today. Van Dyke sets his feet, gets a man over top, oh. and USC's right there to contest him once again with the user's swat from USC. Great defense by 49er George. Yeah, Coach Nelson just got to be careful. One of these, uh, one of these times, it's not going to be a swat. It's going to be an interception. Yeah, those flows just those uh, those passes just haven't been floating the last couple of days like uh, like we're used to. And uh, right there, you're seeing a little short arm once again. Here we go. Shotgun spread formation. Van Dyke hands the ball off to Cheney. And that is just another quick first down 10 yard gain. How are these USC defenders just leaving this wide open like this? Yeah, that Cheney's tough to bring down. Late in the half, sure. maybe you're maybe you're kind of not expecting that, but good play call there by uh, Danny. For sure. And here we go, another 50-50 ball mm. this time. Comes down with it, looking like OBJ out there. Miami, 21, USC, 0. Yeah. And uh, Miami's making some uh, some leeway here. For some reason, Hewitt didn't make a play on that ball, and that's unfortunate for USC because he was in a position to make a play on that ball. That could have been anybody's, anybody's football. Yeah, that was a 50-50 ball. It could have been anybody's ball, but one man came down with it. If you're USC, you can get a score here, get ball back at half. You can get this game within seven. Got to pull out the old, uh, the old secret plays that you, that you run that no one ever sees. Again, wow. gets right through. Yeah, that's going to be a flag on yeah. the play for USC. Unfortunately, Ross stepped out. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if he's got to leave a running back back there to block or slide a tight end or something. He's doing something right on defense to get through there like almost every time. Yeah, this is a vicious uh, D line right now. Absolutely vicious. Moss takes off once again, and Moss should get the first down and just a little bit more, and he does. And that's got to be aggravating for the Miami defense. Yeah, quarterback scrambles for first downs can really irritate a defensive coordinator. <laughs> Moss under center, drops back. Quick out route. And this time Ford gets it, tries to break off the tackle, but Miami does a good job of uh, taking down the uh, USC offensive uh, wide out there. Yeah, touchdown saving tackle. Nobody behind him. And shout out to Moss. Held onto that ball to the very last second. Great timing, great throw. 
And USC's moving the ball here. 43 seconds left. And another big hit. And Moss takes one hard. Mm -hmm. He got up slow like Van Dyke. Huge hit. That linebacker Oof. got right in there. For a second there, I don't think he knew where he was. He got up, went down, got up, went down. It looks like he'll be okay. USC burned a timeout there, by the way. And a quick pass over to Davis to get a nice little chunk left. Good play by USC to make it a third and four. Very manageable. Now you can use two plays to get the first down. Yeah, Danny had his user in position, but George just snuck him and got him underneath. Oh. Speaking of snuck, mm -hmm. another big pick by Danny and the uh, Miami U. That's what they do. That guy came out of nowhere. Didn't even yeah. see him. This is, this is the most uh, interception-ridden team I've ever seen in uh, NCAA football. I mean, this uh, coach, this defense is everywhere. Play action. Van Dyke. Man over top, one man to beat. Eric Wright tries to get the tackle, breaks it off, takes the whole USC Trojans, but they end up getting the man down. Big user gain there. Yeah, easy. He slowed him down enough for his homies to catch up. Yeah, it looks like Miami is not quite done yet. They want to get some more points here before half. Miami using the timeout themselves. Looks like we got a flea ficker here. Wide open, touchdown. Wow, they're pulling out all the stops here tonight, folks. Fleet flickers, in and outs, power rushes. Anything they can do, Miami's doing it. Wild, just wild. What a play. Yeah, beautiful flea flicker. We see those maybe a few times a year, but how many times do we actually see them execute it? And right there, we saw one beautiful pass. And that's what that run game can do for you. Yeah, if you don't run as well as he's been running, it doesn't set that up. We should see a quick rush here. It'll take us to halftime. Moss out. Hand off to Rick Ross. Moss to Ross. And that should take us to halftime. Miami 28, USC 0. I know it looks lopsided right now, but if they can score 28 in the first half, doesn't mean USC can't score 28 in the second half and uh, hold their opponent. Seen it done before many times. Yeah, you're getting ball here at half. Let's just uh, let's get some momentum if you're USC. That was a time. quick first half. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, yeah, quick half time, quick first half. Uh, we had a little, a couple uh, laundry from both teams. Um, offensive pass interference. Then we saw a uh, a misdirection for the uh, USC. Quick play action, another big sack. Moss has to get rid of that ball. This D lines on. Here something. we are. Yeah. I piss test him after the game. <laughs> and what a catch by Ross. Doesn't get too much there, but a good catch other than less. Yeah, close play. That DB was right there. Tried to make a play on the ball, too. Yeah, we got a... Quick hurry up, can barely keep up with the action. A curls for the girls to Ford. I love it. Brings up fourth down. And they're gonna go, it looks like. Yeah, USC's going for it all right now. It's on the table. Moss back. Quick throw. Ball's up. And Miami just bringing that defense. I don't know how they're doing it, but they're getting there very, very quickly. Scary quick. Mm-hmm. Never seen anything like this. Yeah, it's like uh, it's like when you got one of those NFL teams or one of those college teams that could be one of those NFL teams, like a 0 and 16 Lions or 0 and 17. A 
Wow, what a run! Another there. big twenty, yeah, twenty-eight yard pickup. I don't know how he didn't get in. Everything's going right for Miami. That is for sure here tonight, folks. And we are going to have a timeout by Miami. Didn't see something. They, they didn't like something. Do we have an uh, update in the baseball game? Somebody scored. Ross up to the line. Quick handoff. There it is. Does the Olympic style move I was talking about. Another touchdown for Miami U. Miami just doesn't let you think, you know, they just keep attacking you and attacking you and attacking you. Yeah, they got speed at every position. Big amounts of speed. Yeah, this is this is nothing new to me. I mean, they've done it to Cincinnati, they've done it to a few other teams, and this is just what they do. They just attack and, and they attack. I mean they're uh they had a couple rough games last year. Um they 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 lost a game they shouldn't have lost. They had a few other things that shouldn't have happened to them. Um, they had a blackout uh, situation where they got screwed on another game. You know, they feel like they got screwed out of the U.S. out of the uh, out of the championship last year. And they're showing that they want to make it this year. No flaws, no mistakes, complete domination. And that's what's happening in the trenches right now. It's just been happening every year. They or every game this year. I mean, they've just been playing well. But Moss showing heart. And Moss goes down once again. Moss, I don't know how he's walking, but he's still walking, folks. A lot of heart in that kid. Yeah, definitely. USC had some uh, some wideouts open out there. Once he got the pass up, it was already too late. Moss takes a few steps back. 50-75 ball. I'm sorry, 25-75 ball. Do my math correctly. Looks like Miami's playing them for that pass now. Just keep a few guys back there and just uh, try to keep it breezy from here on out. Keep the keep the def keep the uh, offense in front of you. Moss play action. Curls for the girls. Can't. Pro wow. He's got one job, and that's to catch the ball for the first down. And right there, once again, Miami meets up with the uh, wideout to break up the pass. It's crazy. Hey, you got to be disappointed if you're USC. Mm -hmm. Guys just aren't making the big catches. Chaney breaking off one guy, getting a two-yard rush there. Ball on Miami's 13-yard line, four minutes and 38 seconds left. Van Dyke still in the game. Pistol formation, handoff. Number four going to gain just a few yards there. Third and seven. Yep, Trojans filled that hole real quick. Great penetration. Third and seven here. Will we see a pass or we see one of those classic uh, runs from uh, Miami? USC blocking the box there. A quick pass to the outside. Mm. Miami does a quick pass. Gets the first down. Looks like they wanted the touchdown. Looks like they're not done scoring yet. But somehow the guy got wobbly and ended up going uh, out of bounds. First and goal on the two-yard line. Time's still ticking. 
Yeah, Hewitt disrupted him just enough to uh, stumble him out of bounds. Another quick pass. That's going to be another touchdown for the Miami U, 42-0. And uh, I know it was rainy earlier, but it's getting really dreary here now, folks. Ooh, that kicker got smoked. Yeah, they're showing the why they're number three in the nation. Great offense, great defense. When you put it all together, you're going to have a special team this year. And uh, look for Coach Nasa just to uh, – I look for him to be at least uh, a real strong contender uh, for the uh, – for the uh, championship this year. Yeah, I do too. They're uh, they're a tough team to beat. Iowa's got their hands full next week. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> good luck. <laughs> <laughs> just USC just cannot get anything to go their way. Not even a simple catch. It's unbelievable. What do you got to do to buy a catch here? Moss making some checks to the left side here. Moss got some feet in the back. Quick pass to Rick Ross. Eight yard gain there. Third and two. Okay, he actually got some protection from his line. He got some time in the pocket. Things are developing. You just. Yeah, you're just working on some things for next week. Rick Ross now showing some quick feet. Where was his feet at earlier in the game? Made a nice little cut. First down there. He's Trojans got... moving the ball. Pretty sure he's got 96 speed. Moss under center. Moss back, sets his feet. And another big INT for Miami. And we do have a flag. We got some laundry on the field, folks. And it will be declined, and it will be Miami's ball. Mm. I expect Miami just to run the ball from here on out or maybe get some of them uh, second team in. Definitely don't want to see any injuries or anything if you're either one of these teams. It's a good time to get that uh, get that back up in there. And Cheney's taking out to the ball to the right side, getting a seven yard gain there. Saw the speed of Ross there as he was able to chase down Cheney on that corner. I mean, another quick handoff, number four, right up the middle. It's going to be another quick first down with a big eight-yard gain. And I believe that's Knight, if I'm not, if I'm not uh, mistaken. Yeah, I think it's Knighton. Knighton? Knighton. It's filling in nicely for Chaney here. Yeah, I mean, Chaney's already done everything he needs to do this game. So we do have a quarterback change here. Martinez. And it looks like he could be hurt. Brings in the backup. No. The backup. <laughs> yeah. and, you, and you can see the coach is just like, absolutely, what is going on? That's why we brought this guy in. Oh, well, at no. least you brought him in. That could have been Van Dyke. <laughs> Pinche Martinez. <laughs> no mommies. No. Oh. You hate to see it. <laughs> oh, what are the chances? Van Dyke back out here. Man in motion. Quick handoff to Cheney. 
up the middle, a little wiggle. And picks up maybe a yard, third and seven. And that should take us to the fourth quarter. Yeah, that hole closed pretty quickly there. Put them fours up in chat. And that will do it. Here we go, fourth quarter. Van Dyke still in the game. Haven't got a update from Martinez yet. It looks like Miami's calling a timeout. Either somebody or something out there they're not liking. Excuse me, the backup's name is Jake Garcia. Garcia? Ah. Another quick off to uh, Knighton. Knighton. <laughs> This will be a fourth and one. Looks like they're going to elect to kick the ball here. Ball's up. Looks good. And that is a 45-yard-plus uh, field goal there, folks. And Miami will add three more points to their lead. 45-yard field goal gives them 45 points. Perfect. And I don't think we saw one kick return this game so far. I think he's, I think Bryant has pulled, brought one out of the end zone. They brought one out. Mm -hmm. I've seen nothing but a bunch of waves out there. Mm -hmm. Moss under center. Sets his feet. And another big pick by number three out there. And something that Miami does, I just don't know how they get so many picks. I don't know if they do baseball drills, catching drills, what it is. I don't know what they're doing, but somehow they're just mastered the INT. Good hands. Maybe the tennis ball drill? Maybe. I'd like to pick his brain for 20 minutes. Mmm. A fancy uh, no yard gain there by Miami. <laughs> A lot of dancing for not much yardage. Yeah, but they keep the ball in, they keep the clock moving, and they do the uh, the good sportsmanship thing. Garcia, backfield. Quick handoff to Cheney. Cheney a couple juke moves. Gain of, looks like a gain of four, possibly. Mm-hmm. Third and six here. Ball in the 24-yard line. Garcia, two back set. Hand off to Cheney. Just going to keep on pounding. Nothing special. I think everybody in the stadium knows what's coming at this point. Right? It ain't broke. Time. Up. Don't fix it. Yep. Time will just keep on ticking. Fourth and three. Looks like we'll see another field goal from the field goal unit. Ross trying to jump the snap. And Miami adds three more points to the lead. Another touchback here. Mm -hmm. Add it to the list. Fourth down, 404 left on the 24 yard line. So, four is your favorite number. Make sure you go play it tonight at your local lottery. Ma, shotgun formation, making some checks.
Moss just can't do no right right now. No. Those hurricane defenders are just everywhere. <laughs> yeah. I mean, at this point, it's just comical. Two back set. Knighton takes the ball. Five yard gain. Much has been the fourth quarter. Just a bunch of pound and pound and pound, you know. Just keep this clock moving. Little trick play. Out to the 10. Drops down to his knee there. Good sportsmanship. Keep the clock moving. I believe we gain. I believe we have a game on uh, Thursday. I believe uh, it will be uh, Michigan in uh, Texas A&M. Number one, Texas A&M. Mm hmm. Yeah, Forrest Gump's been looking good this year. Um, so I'm interested in. Uh, you know, watching his uh, game this week, uh, this week coming up, uh, Gump's been doing a lot of big things, and uh, Michigan's been looking uh, pretty tough as well. Can't take anything away from uh, Fam and the uh, and the Wolverines. Make sure you check Twitter, stay up to date with all the game times. USC there making a huge stop. Garcia gain a zero. Saw a lot of ne negatives, a lot of positives in this game for both teams. And uh, all you can do is just build off of it. Man in motion for Miami. Turns it into a two back set. Screenplay. And just getting a guy open, just trying to keep the clock moving. Easy passes, staying inside the, uh, staying inside the pylon there, just to keep the clock going. Kick is up, right through the uprights. This kid's trying to win the Groza in one game. Yeah, the kicker's getting a lot of work in here the last uh, last fourth quarter here. I want to see return Brian ball. Jr. going to be taking up. Yeah, here we go. Brian Jr. making a hell of a break tackle there. Embarrassing a guy. Yeah, Brian's, Brian can be dangerous. And I uh, did see a lot of Miami... Uh, a lot of Miami... Uh, fans in the stands here it's a long uh it's a long flight you know what i'm saying from florida to, uh, to california very long flight 40 seconds left here Let's see if we can get some of these coaches in the booth after the game Keep it short and sweet so me and Bone can run over and catch the end of that baseball game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you got to be uh, aggravated for USC. All of a sudden, your guys want to start catching the ball here late in the fourth quarter. And there it is, folks. Miami takes a takes home a big victory here tonight, folks. Miami undefeated. They believe uh, they've moved to uh, was that four four now five and now four now four now yeah four now. All right, let's we'll see if we can't get uh, Coach Nosages in here and uh, 
give him some quick questions and uh, let him get to his food. <laughs> How's it going, guys? How'd you guys know? <laughs> I saw the king size drinks. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this mother, the DoorDash guy had the audacity to ask for a tip, so I almost, I almost left the game to whoop some ass. Yeah. Where's my tip? You know, we always tip on the app. Always tip your <laughs> your delivery guys. Yeah, <laughs> I got a tip. Stay out of dark alleys at night. <laughs> well, I mean. <sighs> What a game, Coach. That's all I can say. Your defense played well. Uh, your offense played it even better. Um, there was, I mean, the, the the deep pass wasn't there. USC absolutely took away the deep pass, but everything else was there. I mean, how did your team play overall in your, uh, you know, from your expectations? Uh, I mean, it was it was kind of one of those games that every, you, I guess everything just went right for us and everything went wrong for George. And it was unfortunate, but... You know the games really, really. Uh, it's it's really evident when it, when one team is going to be favored in the game, and you can tell like George's guys were dropping everything. Uh, his running backs were like stumbling on their own. It was just one of those games where I felt like it was just going to be uh, an EA shit show, for lack of a better word. Yeah, that's basically. I mean, you said it best. Um, just felt like a one-sided game out there and uh, you capitalized and you know it's not really much you can do out there when the game's doing you know when the game's being like that but after a few restarts you guys got it in um but really if you win the game by 51 or one point a win's a win and uh you're definitely going to take it and uh you know congratulations on the big win jimmy you got anything yeah, uh, moving forward, go into complete detail what you plan to do against Iowa. Uh, complete detail. I mean, right now our, our run defense, our, our defense is is as a whole is really, really scary right now. Um, I've always struggled against George because of his multiple, his like West Coast style. Uh, but once the game kind of played itself, like I, I felt it was going to be to be very different but our run defense this year is, is ridiculous I don't, I don't exactly know what's what's going on um as, as, a, as a team we're doing really good stopping the run and when we force people to be one dimensional it kind of it, it puts a lot of pressure on them i think we only gave up three yards this game um so you know it's just that that's kind of the biggest thing if our defense comes shows up to play the game's going to be a little bit different for us yeah, the defense definitely showed up to play. Good game, Coach. We'll see you next week. Thank you, guys. Appreciate you guys calling and producing. George, love you, brother. Appreciate you playing against me. All right, see if we can get George up in here. GG's, man. GG's. What's up, boys? What's going on, George? Chilling, man. We all know. Yeah, we know how tough this Miami team is. I mean, there's no, there's no shame out here or anything. I mean, you guys couldn't get anything going. As far as the uh, wideouts were going, uh, it's hard to move the ball. I mean, it's just, you know, this is a nightmare when you play Snossages. Yeah, that's what it was. Yep. Got to regroup yeah, for next tough. week. Yeah, it's tough out here. Who we got next week? AM. AM. Yeah, you know you want to uh, knock dumb boys off. You know you do. Thanks, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Number one in the nation. Hopefully they'll still be number one next week when you see them. Um, that'll give your uh, team some good clout if you can get a, a nice little upset over that uh, over that A&M. And you know them well, I heard. Yeah, well, we don't have to travel. We'll be back. Mm. Is uh, Moss going to continue to be your starter? Fuck Moss. <laughs> Jimmy, you got anything? What do you got in store for Coach Briefcase when he comes to Southern Cal? Fuck that guy, too. <laughs> <laughs> Can't agree more, pimp. <laughs> Meet you at La Vix. Yeah, well, if we see you at the High Life Lounge, uh, we'll get you some drinks in you and uh, we'll make your night better. <laughs> All right, bet. Yeah. See you at yeah. La Vix. GG's. All right, coach. <laughs> oh, who are we raiding, Bowen? Um, 
I don't know. <laughs> mm, I guess FG or Clink. Yeah, I think we hit Clink last night, didn't we? We can hit him again. I think we did. He can hit him again. He is in the NW. And it looks like uh, Coach JT's uh, showed up in the building. Who's uh, who's Cincinnati play next? Uh, Clink. Uh oh. Alright. I can't type. Hey, it worked. Sweet. Appreciate everybody. Good game, coaches. Appreciate you, Bowen. Good call. Yeah. Appreciate you, Jimmy. Got any last words? No, no, no. Perfect. Just then, uh, enjoy the rest of your Tuesday and uh, watch the rest of this All-Star game, boys. Yeah, go watch some baseball. Good game. Later, guys.